Welcome back to the channel. We got this uh, garage in a box from Tractor Supply. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun. It's Shelter Logic yep. Landowner Series. I think it's specifically made just for tractor supply. Yes, yes, it is. It looks like it's designed just for them. They got their name on it, on the instructions. So the shelter is 12 feet by 20 feet long. And 8 feet tall? 8 feet high. In the yep. center. So that'll fit the tractor. Yes, but the opening for the little door section here is just about three inches short according to the height Specs. yeah what's our problem we don't have the tractor here <laughs> to actually check the fit so but we're gonna go ahead and assemble this thing and uh when we get the tractor we'll figure out what we're gonna do we'll figure out what we got to do to make it work we have a couple of ideas yeah we've been brainstorming and we read the reviews on this shelter logic and apparently it's not the easiest thing to assemble so we read through the instructions, at least I did. <laughs> yeah, we looked it over. <laughs> Richie usually throws them away. <laughs> it says here, th three, three strong men. What? It does not. <laughs> An adult times three should only take two hours. So how long should it take you and I? Three hours. All day. <laughs> All day. <laughs> we'll get back to you. <laughs> All right. This is the spot we picked. Yeah. It's not really level but we're gonna do the best we can to get it as level as we can and put it up. Triple bonus pack, extra stuff. Yeah, huh? That's what makes it so awesome at Tractor Supply. And it's got the heavier nine ounce plastic instead of the seven ounce. All right, so Richie says he hates using adjustable wrenches, so he's probably gonna find a, a regular wrench. We're not gonna use the goggles. We've got the two things of rope. We've got the measuring tape, the 18 inch piece of pipe that they want you to use to screw in the, the what are those things called? Anchors. Anchors. We don't have that, but we will find something. We have a ladder, we have the adjustable wrench, and we have the 716 socket. We are ready to go. That's a lot of screws. Okay, I just wanted to take a second to show you. There are two different screw sizes, and the bag of hardware was just everything all mixed together. So I just took a minute and went through and separated out the short screws versus the long screws. But look at the difference. It's literally a tiny, tiny little difference. So very easy to make a mistake. You can't mess it up. No, you can't mess that up. All you could mess up is put the wrong screw. Is this a long one or a short one? That, here, this is a long. So that's a short. Yeah. So same. the longer screws go with the bracket. Mm-hmm. This is a short screw. Yep. Because no, there's no, no bracket. bracket. Got you got it. a shorty? I have a shorty. Where they drill the metal. There's a little burn there. Look at it. I know you will. There it is. You can see it sticking out where the screw's gonna go. Where's the screw? So the time lapse stopped before we were done, but we have the entire frame set up. What we're going to do now is tighten it up and put some gravel underneath some of the legs to level it out. Limit to what we can do. Oh, we know what we have. Let's hold on tight. We couldn't get the anchors all the way in the ground. We have way too many rocks, but that's about what? At least a third of the way? Half. At halfway, okay. Those things so, are long. <laughs> and then we did the other side. This side went a little bit further before we hit a rock. It does go uphill a little bit. So we did try to dig some of the corners in, in the back to make the, uh, the pitch uphill a little less. Found what we're looking for in life. Crazy, but things are finally 
We're going to start putting the canopy on the front first before we really square it up because we realized that the panels need to be kind of intertwined with the bars. Like the top bar there has to come apart and this bar here and the sidebar has to come apart in order to put the front on. And it doesn't feel 12 feet wide, right honey? What did we figure out? If we stretch the frame to 12 feet where it's supposed to, according to the directions, it puts way too much stress on it and I don't like it. It's more like 11 feet, six inches. So we're gonna see if we can get away with 11 feet, six inches by putting the front and the back on and see how they fit before we decide what we're gonna do. We got the corners right, right? We measured 23 yeah. feet, four inches from corner yeah. to corner, yeah. but it just doesn't wanna go to 12 feet wide. You also, if you look at the ribs, it's not perfectly round. It's like a, a bump and a bump and a bump. Pulling the sides out gives it this little bump down, which just, again, doesn't make sense. So it doesn't really feel like this is supposed to go to 12 feet wide. Anything else? No, that's it. Let's put this front on. The strap that goes through, this is the top. Mm -hmm. And apparently when they cut this, Mm -hmm. It looks like they cut the strap and that is definitely going to mess with its integrity um, Maybe we'll use this one as the back. Let's check the other one and see if the same is true and So we'll use this one as the front because all the cuts all right. are fine This is what it's supposed to look like. See how this is open and the strap comes down this way? This is not open. It's like they didn't cut it enough. Ready? Yep. All right, pull. Keep pulling. Pull hard. Harder. But you see, this is a wall right here. Look, it's tearing it up already. But I do kind of like it. So far, it's looking good. If I stand in the center and look down, it looks pretty centered. We got time on our side. We're in a state of home. It endured its first rain last night. You want to unzip it and take a peek inside? It, it actually looks good. I like the way the water's going to run right off the side down the hill. Okay. Oh, it's hot in there. Oh my God. Well, you know what that's good for? The winter. Yeah, it'll keep it warm. It'll definitely keep it a little warmer than normal. Yeah, so far so good. We did a good job, Kat. Considering that it says that it needs three plus men, we've now learned that I, one woman, can do the job of at least two or more men. Would you agree? I agree. I'd be foolish not to agree. <laughs> it took us two days, right? Yeah. About four or five hours each day. Yeah, because when the sun came out and it was beating down over here, we stopped. Yeah, definitely. And that's it. Another addition to our little spot here in the woods. Yeah, and hopefully the tractor will fit in there. Yeah, hopefully. We don't have it to test it yet. We'll see. We're gonna make it fit. Yeah. All right, thanks for watching. I'm Rich. And I'm Kathy. And we are creating a simpler life here in the Adirondacks. Yes, we are. You know, every time